Hello and welcome to the Chamber of E-Commerce. My name is Don Collis. I'm the founder and the president of the Chamber of E-Commerce. And today we're going to be doing some training um, on how to use the forum inside of the website, the Chamber of E-Commerce.com. And uh, let's go ahead and get started. If you haven't signed in or signed up, this is the, the form that you're going to see. Um, it's basically just a welcome app suggestion box and show and tell. And this is for the businesses that are already signed up as members can, can publicize uh, their websites. Um, but the rest of the stuff is pretty much closed off. There's not a lot of whole much more you can do besides read those three topics there but when you sign in we'll show you how to sign in here just go ahead and, and sign up for an account um, we're already signed up for an account so when I go in here and sign in with my account when I sign in with my account it's gonna let me have access to all the goodies and functions and features um, that just the guest couldn't have access to so let's go ahead and go over to the form now I'm gonna go ahead and do a refresh here and we'll see a difference on the page here the way that it looks now that we're signed in and here we go we're signed in welcome and it says your name up there you can show your latest post uh, you look at your profile here for the forum you can log out announcements and do an advanced search uh, make sure you check by and make sure you look and read all the rules of the forum here this has all the terms conditions as far as the site the general rules and stuff like that um, the only place that you're allowed to do advertising about your business is in that category um, for your business. Now here's our Facebook group. We'll have this posted up on uh, our Facebook group where you can sign in and utilize and just get some more information about some of our things there plus also connect with some of our Facebook friends. But today we're going to go ahead and look back and go to the um, the form itself. We're going to do a little in informational uh, uh, cast here uh, about what you can use. Now this as you see um, there, there is a lot of information here as far as different sections. We're going to be adding some more sections as time progresses. Um, you can go in here and say we want to go ahead and look at servers and hosting. We'll make a comment and ask some questions about that. Um, there's a lot of different ways that we can do this and that will help you all, uh, out a lot here. Uh, the first thing we want to go ahead and do if you have a question go ahead and click on new thread and that's going to bring us to a, a section there with an editor that we can ask her questions. Um, we can put the subject about um, servers and hosting. Um, how to start a hosting account as a question, a little test question we're going to ask. We can select if it has any icons up here. If you like any of those, you can use those. Um, there's also a message box that we can type our messages in. Um, let's go ahead and type something in here real quick. I I had a question about how to host my website. Um, and we put that in there, a little thing in here. Now, a really great uh, part of this is that not only can you go in here and just put plain text, you can also bold, on, uh, italicize, underline. Um, there's a lot of other things in here. You can select what kind of font you want to use. Um, here is some colors. Um, you can, there's also some information here as well as uh, formatting options. Um, you can also put um, code highlighter if it concerns a piece of code. We can add pictures, an image link to a, a URL of your pictures. We can add a website link, and we can also add uh, uh, YouTube or other videos inside of this thing. So let's go ahead and push that right there. We can do the size. Let's make this uh, 400. I can go ahead and make the height to say uh, 400, make it square. Um, Put all this stuff in there. Copy this over. There we go. Provider. There's a whole list of different providers in here that you can pull videos in from. So check those right there out. Today we're going to go ahead and show a one from YouTube. It has a lot of different things inside of here that you can put uh, videos into. The ID or the URL. Let's go ahead and take one of the videos on our YouTube video page from the Chamber of E-Commerce. And I'm going to go ahead and go to my videos look at the videos that I've had and created and this is say the website is open now this is a really good video we just put this one up and what we want to do is go to the side here and copy this URL copy that and go back in here to our post I want to put that URL in there paste that and do it insert alright and we have that all in there it's really good and now what we're going to go ahead and do we can attach an image to this we can attach a file for this if it concerns those two different things um, and I'm going to go ahead and do a preview and it's going to show us what that looks like
and there we go um, the Chamber of E-Commerce website it has some information there uh, I had a question about the website and uh, it's a really great thing to do there and what you might want to do is when you do the videos you can test this out back and forth it looks like we need to go ahead and put a little inner break space right there so what we need to do is go ahead and come up here to the top and um, go beside the end of there but that code starts hit enter a couple times I want to go ahead and do another preview and let it take a look at that and let it pull up through And there we go. So we had a question there we did it for a video. And we're also going to be posting video answers to your questions through the forum and showing you a little bit more insight about how to do different things. Um, so that right there works really great. And you also subscribe. You can subscribe here. It's automatic default where you submit it if you don't uncheck that box there. And basically this will let you know every time someone puts an answer to your question or comment, it will send you an email and say, hey, there's an answer been done to this uh, question or comment there and it's that right there is really cool um, we also have the emotions here you can use those as smileys um, we have a lot of other different things in here as well so this is just a basic overview of how to use um, this uh, the form how to post answers and questions um, we'll go ahead and do hit submit submit and that's going to go ahead and let it propagate to the website now it's going to let us know you're you have been subscribed to this topic and your message has been successfully posted and we can go ahead and return to the topic and take a look at that and there we go I had a question about hosting my website and there's a little video right there we can ask questions that show people our screen and there's a lot of different tools out there that you can do that so people can answer your questions in through uh, this uh, forum through video and you can an ask those questions through video as well um, so it's a really great way for you guys out there who have questions and to be able to get um, solid answers um, for your questions and it's a members only uh, forum so you can be able to, members are only the ones able to um, post questions and answers inside of the forum but this has been the the forum tutorial on how to use the forum um, you can also go back and check stuff for your, as far as your forum profile uh, let's go ahead and take a look at that real quick now with your forum profile it's different than your your uh, community uh, profile and we'll have some more information in here that you don't have on your regular profile just for the forum you can put personal text uh, birthday if you want to location um, if you're using ICQ AIM uh, Yahoo Instant Messenger MSN Skype um, Gtalk you can put your website name website URL any kind of signature in there as well so this is really great you, you can edit your profile information you can look at your post your subscribers to your post and your favorite post um, as, as well knows and you can also edit your detail and look at your summary there too so this is really a great place for anybody out there to be able to ask questions get answers give answers and help the community and help network who you are and find out some really relevant data about you know your questions online again what we do inside this the forum is unlike any other forum when you go out there and you make a post and this section of the, the forum, when you post those questions onto the forum, we do those video responses, and we also write articles and do a podcast off of those topics as well. Because we believe if you have a question and it's that important you to ask that question, we're going to give you as much content as you can possibly get on those different topics. So again, we go ahead and write uh, articles, we do videos, uh, we show you related links, and if there's any downloads that are relating to what you're talking about or any needs in that area, we'll show you how to get those as well. Well, this has been Don Collis, the uh, president of the Chamber of uh, E-Commerce and the founder. And thank you for watching this video. We hope that you have any questions about how to use the form. Uh, put those in the uh, suggestion box. And uh, any suggestions for the site or, or the form, you can put those suggestions there when, once you log in. Uh, thanks again for coming to the site. We appreciate uh, you coming to the site. Uh, thank you for joining our Facebook group and logging in. Uh, we'll talk to you next time on the Chamber of E-Commerce.